In this video, we will show you how to use custom permalink structure for your WooCommerce online store. What is permalink? So basically permalink, it is a nice link structure for your website. So for example, this is your shop page, right? If you see the URL, you will see that the URL will have this format so basically it is looks nice for me sometimes you will it is better to have let's say slash shop so it is easy to remember and you can share it easily to your friend or your when you promote your online store so let's go to the dashboard you can go to the settings permalinks Right now, you still use the default permalink. You can choose, for example, this is my favorite, postname. I will click postname, and then I will click save change. Okay, I will refresh this page again. Right now, when I click the sub page again, right now it is already slash sub slash. So, it is good. You can visit your chart page slash chart check out also. Now, for example, I will click one of your product, Flying Ninja. You can see that the URL right now it is slash product slash Flying Ninja. Oh, sometimes I would like to see it is slash shop slash flying ninja to make it consistent you can do it so let's go to the permalinks page again okay and then you can see you have some option here product or sub page i will choose sub page for this case okay i will go to the sub page again and then I will click flying ninja again and now you will see it is slash shop slash flying ninja okay this is cool mm, let's say if you want to see your category on your product URL for example flying ninja it is on poster directory uh, I'm sorry poster product category you can do that also for example okay I will choose sub base with category I will click save change and now I will visit sub page again and I will click flying ninja again and then you can see now the complete URL for your flying ninja product is slash shop slash poster slash Flying Ninja. It is good, right, for you? Okay, thank you very much.